Hi guys, uh, welcome to my channel. It's your boy Onyeka. Welcome to my channel. If you're new here, please do make sure to hit that subscribe button below and turn on notification bell so you can be um, notified whenever I upload a new video. All right, thank you, thank you, thank you. Welcome. Um, I made a friend. I made a friend. Yeah, from Instagram. Uh, I was DM'd and the person is from Kudus. Kurdistan, yeah, from correct, yeah, the Kurds, and uh, I would like to know more about the Kurds, and I'm gonna react on a video, T top ten facts about Kurdistan, about yeah, about Kurdistan, which are the Kurds. Uh, this is um, like I haven't really heard about the Kurdistan's before, so I'm gonna react on that top ten facts to know more about them. So I urge you guys, please, to come over to the Instagram. So we can talk and we can get to know ourselves and I so you can uh, recommend videos for me to react on also. All right, let's check this video out uh, without further much ado and uh, here we go. Not everyone knows who the Kurds yeah. are or what Kurdistan is. It is actually after the recent events against the Islamic State that the Kurdish question have become an international one. Today we will list our top 10 facts about Kurds and Kurdistan. If you want to spread the words about the Kurds and about Kurdistan, you should share this video and also don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell button in order to not miss any of our future videos. So our first point, number 10, is the Kurdish family tree. Kurds are a Middle Eastern ethnic group. They are neither Arabs or Turks and has no related connection with these. The Kurds are culturally and linguistically closely related to the Iranian people and as a result are often themselves classified as an Iranian or Iranic people. Number 9. The fighter inside the Kurds The Kurds are descendants not only from one specific people, but several ones. Both Kardushes and the Medes are mentioned as the Kurdish ancestors. Looking at the Kardushi ancestors, we can see a fierce race of bowmen who in the winter of 401 BC caused more harm to the Greeks in seven days of hit and run raids and the Persian did during the entire war against the Greeks. One of the Greek officers wrote that the Kardushi were not to be messed with, mentioning that a royal army of 120,000 had once invaded the Kardushi country and not a man had returned. Fast forwarding further into the future, we know about the strength of the Kurdish military under control of Kurdish general Saladin, who both won back Palestine, including Jerusalem, from the Crusaders. A saying says that Kurds are born with a weapon in their hand, and this is of course helpful in such a hostile environment. In modern time, the Kurds have under the name of Bajmerga and Guerrilla made successful gains against the Islamic State in a moment when everybody else fled their positions. Number 8. ISIS are afraid of Kurdish women <laughs> Kurdish women, especially within the YPG, says that they have one huge psychological advantage in the fight against ISIS soldiers who think that being killed by a Kurdish woman will send them directly to hell. One Kurd that joined the struggle to protect women rights says that she thinks ISIS is more afraid of them than of the men. Women in the Peshmerga and YPJ are trained as regular fighters using snipers, rocket grenades or regular weapon kits, just like the men. It's in a big contrast towards how women are treated in the rest of the Middle East, where in many places one is not allowed to visit the market or leaving the house Number without seven, a Number 7. Batman in Kurdistan Did you know that Batman guards Kurdistan during the nights? No, we're not talking about the DC comic hero Batman, but about the Kurdish city of Batman, which is located in Turkish-occupied Kurdistan. 
Even though the name Batman is the Turkish one for the city, the name Batman still marks a funny point in our list. Number 6. Religion in Kurdistan Kurdistan is known to be a safe heaven of religions. This reputation comes from the tolerant coexisting environment that runs through the Kurdish society while surrounding areas have marked persecutions against religious belongings. In Kurdistan, Muslims, Jews, Christians, Yazidis and many many more religious minorities live together in peace and harmony, and that's been the case as far as we can go in history. Number 5. Oil of Kirkuk The Kurdish city of Kirkuk is one of the world's richest oil export sources. Under the soil of Kirkuk over 10 billion barrels is located. Wow. The oil of Kirkuk were discovered in the 1920s and immediately made different groups lay claim on the city. The city has a mixed population and if you want to know more about the history of Kirkuk, we have a video where we discuss and inform about Kirkuk, so be sure to check that out. Number 4. Mountain of Ararat The largest mountain of Kurdistan is named Ararat. The top of the mountain reaches 5120 meters over the sea. As addition, it is also the mountain where the Ark of Noah from the Bible is supposed to have stranded. Number 3. Lake of Van The Lake of Van is another important place in Biblical history. This is claimed to be the so-called Garden of Eden, where Adam and Eve lived. The lake is Kurdistan's largest one, with a max deep of 451 meters down. And now let's go over to number 2, Animals of Kurdistan. Animals plays an important role in Kurdish culture. Among all animals, some either plays a holy role or a symbolic role. Among these are the eagle, the chucker, the patridge, the European hare, the peafowl, the capra, the van cat, the roaster, the fish and the wild boar. So for our top 1 we have the woman of Kurdistan. The Kurdish female fighters is one of a kind in the world. In the organization of the YPJ within borders of Rojava, the Kurdish women have caught international attention for their bravery and courage. In other Kurdish groups such as the PKK, Pejak and Peshmerga, there is branches of women fighting alongside the men for their country and their lives. The female fighters of the YPJ are approximately 30,000 units, which makes them the largest women force in the Middle East. What do you think about our top 10 list? Comment below which point you believe that we missed and hit the like button if you want us to make another list like this video. Wow! Wow, 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 wow. The, uh, the Kurdish stands. <laughs> this top 10 facts, uh, it's incredible. Like that of the female fighters, that part, I find it funny, but uh, it's a very beautiful one. Like the female fighters, uh, they, they stand together to fight for their country. That's a very beautiful one. And Mountain Ararat. Is in Kurdistan. Wow, that is where I was wowed by seeing that uh, it is um it is from Kurdistan. That is where um Moses' boat, uh, the ark, sorry, was laid on top of it. And that's a very beautiful one. And yeah, from the video and everything I'm seeing, Kurdistan is a beautiful place. But it's um it's a place that I haven't as in is not well heard of. Like wow, I was even shocked to hear about Kurdistan. 
But to be honest with you, it's a very nice place. It's a nice place, and uh, it seems it's gonna be in my top ten list of places I wanna go to. Also, I'm gonna make a vlog, a very a very good video about those places, and and I can't wait. I can't wait. I can't wait. I just due to this um corona, uh, this uh, corona stuff and pandemic. Traveling is now hard. Even in my country, like you can't even travel because there is no um, what's it called? Sorry, the protocols for the corona is just too much. You can't travel. But I just can't wait for all these things to end so the traveling can begin, and I can't wait to be in Kurdistan. It's a nice place, and uh, I heard, I heard, um, I heard from somewhere. I read, no, I read it in an article that Kurdistan. Is not a country, and I was shocked. And I was like, "Are this are this people for real? Like, it's not a country, and it's so large. If it's not a country, then it's what? Yeah, they said it's on its own. Wow, the country is. There are lots of stuffs in it. So amazing, amazing stuffs in it, and it's making me want to come soonest. Anyways, that's it on this video. If you have um opinions or anything towards this video use the comment section to drop your opinion towards this video all right make sure to give a like on this video and share to your friends and family and subscribe also all right i'll see you guys in my next video and stay safe and be happy okay i will talk to you in my next video bye